it's one of the, probably the, one of the most popular events of the year for everybody. Um, the golf course is great. It's in good shape, a little softer this year than normal, so it's playing a bit longer, so I think it'll play into some people's hands. Um, but it's, yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a great golf course. Yeah, it's an interesting one. I actually just hit three wood off the 18th tee, which never crossed my mind last year, because it's like, oh, hit driver and see, see if you can go for it in two. But there's definitely a few holes where, because it's wet, you're not going to be getting there, you know, like a par five in two or something. And I think sometimes it makes more sense to take the trouble out of play and, and play it like that. So they can they can move a few things around during the week, though. Yeah, lovely course. Um, obviously played here last year. Um, it was a bit firmer last year, but this year a bit softer and um, playing a bit longer, but still in great condition. Uh, I really like the course. It's a great layout, very fun and challenging course. Um, the condition is great. Uh, I've heard they've had a lot of rain uh, in the summer, so it looks amazing considering that. And I wouldn't even have guessed that it's been a lot of rain. So yeah, it's great. I mean, you can play the par fives strategically or you can go for them, which I think is a, is a good sign of a golf course. Uh, so it'll be interesting because obviously last year's winner, Clara, wasn't the longest hitter in the world, but I think in general, it would favor the longer hitter for sure.